Hello everyone, you might have heard about organ transplantations at some part of your life and even wondered why can't we use the animal organs for transplantations. So in this video, we'll deal on the basic knowledge on transplantations. January 2022 has brought this new interesting news which is a groundbreaking step in human organ transplantation. A successful attempt of pig heart transplantation to humans. So why do you think it was successful? Let's talk about it. Let's begin with some general information about transplantation. Transplantation is the transplant or transfer of an organ from one body to another body. It can be the transplant of an organ as a whole, for example kidney, or partial organ transplant, for example liver. So liver is an organ that is capable of self-regeneration and that's why only a part can be transplanted in someone's body and which is why it's called a partial organ transplant. And by convention, avascular organs, meaning organs which do not have their own blood supply, are relatively easier for transplantation. For example, the cornea of your eye and the cartilage. There are some terminologies you ought to know before understanding this whole thing about transplantation. There is this thing called as graft. Graft is an organ or tissue that is to be transplanted. Donor, which means the giver, is someone who donates the organ and he is someone who originally owns the graft. Recipient means the receiver of the organ or a person to whom the organ is to be transplanted. And rejections are a really complicated and an important event that occurs during the transplantation process commonly, which means the body reacts and destroys the transplanted organs, initially damaging the functions and gradually damaging the structure as a whole. In advanced state, the transplanted organ liquefies as a result of rejection. So the people who get transplantation are often advised to take immunosuppressive medications which are used to suppress the immune system for either some part of their life or their entire life so that their immune system does not act upon or reject the graft. So there can be various types of transplantation. Auto meaning self. Autograft is the transplant that is performed within the same body. For example, your hair transplantation. You remove your hair from one part of your body and then transplant it to your head. That's a simple example I can give. Iso meaning similar. So the isograft is the transplantation between identical twins. Allograft, which is the transplant between two bodies but same species commonly occurs in humans and the example can be a kidney transplant from one human to another. Xenograft is the type of transplantation between two different species, for example heart valve transplant. And this transplantation that has recently occurred is a revolutionary step in medicine and this too is an example of genograft. As I earlier mentioned, January 2022 has brought us this amazing news which truly is a revolution in human organ transplantation medicine. A man from the United States named David Bennett has been the first person in the world to get a heart transplant from a genetically modified pig. He's doing really well so far. Talking about the patient himself, he is a 57-year-old male from US who was diagnosed with terminal heart disease. He was deemed ineligible for a human heart transplant and this decision was made by doctors since he was extremely weak with poor health condition. So doctors obviously don't want to waste organ in such scenario where the results are doubtful. David was bedridden for 6 weeks and attached to a machine which kept him alive after being diagnosed with the disease. So he didn't have much choices left, either to die in few days or to try upon this new modality of treatment. And let me tell you, the law of organ transplantations is really very strict and varies with the country. And organ transplantation from an animal is also not legal, so they needed a special grant for carrying out this procedure. The doctors at Maryland Medical Center received this special grant dispensed by the U.S. medical regulator to carry out the procedure. 
and it occurred under the supervision of University of Maryland School of Medicine. This is not the first time somebody have tried transplantation with other animals. Many unsuccessful attempts were done in the past. Pig heart valves were already being used in the valve replacement surgery in cardiothoracic surgery by the name porcine. Another significant attempt was made on October 2021. On this day, pig kidney was transplanted to a brain dead person. After years of research, surgeon Bartley Griffith and his team successfully transplanted pig's heart to human body. The function of the heart was normal and it was beating regularly. These pigs were not just the normal pigs but they were genetically modified during the embryonic life by knocking off many genes that are responsible to result rejections. Such rejection evoking genes were deleted and then the pigs were reared carefully in the lab for future organ harvesting. After the pigs were adult, the heart was taken and transplanted to human body for the first time in history. This revolutionary step may possibly decrease the organ scarcity for transplantation in coming future. The doctors have mentioned that this is one step closer to solving the organ shortage crisis. So let's hope for the best. That's all for today. It's your like and subscription that keeps our channel alive. Just like the transplantation saved Mr. Bennett. Thanks for watching till the end. If you like the video, do give it a thumbs up and leave a subscription down below. This is made it. Made it for you.